doing ladies and gentlemen i hope you're having a fantastic day so we're here today with the expanse season four episode three reaction the summer is here um the summer is here for me it is absolutely boiling you, you probably will be able to hear the fan usually i always have it on on one now it's on three it, i think yesterday was like the hottest day ever today it may even surpass it so what i'm gonna say is if you can hear the fan Sorry, but that's not going to change. <laughs> Sorry, but that's not going to change. That's why I put the mic a little bit closer. So, like, you can still hear me, obviously, all the fun. And then, like, wait later on, for obviously those watching in the highlights, um, you have the video will be much louder as well. So, you can hear the video clearly as well. And if you're watching this on full length, well, obviously, you're able to sync it yourself. But I hope you're all good, ladies and gentlemen. So, last episode, we had Murtri. Murtry. Um kind of reminded me now that I think about it, now that I think about the name, kind of reminds me of um Interstellar. Murph. Murph. Come on, Murph. Love that movie. Um Noland, in my opinion, makes makes some of the best movies out there. Um the Batman trilogy, oof. The Dark Knight, oof, my favourite film of all time. My favourite film of all time, I have to say straight out, you know, straight up, my favourite film of all time. Um But yeah, we had Murtry kind of just being like, okay, you know what? We're all cool. We're all cool. We're all cool. Oh, did you just threaten me? It's like, mm, he seems like one of those loose cannons. That isn't actually a loose cannon. It's a weird way to just, like, he seems like one of those people that, like, he understands your position, but the second you come after him, like, the second you actually threaten him, I was, I was going to say physically threaten him, but, like, they weren't physically threatening him. They were more so just threatening him. To do something physically later, but not like physically threatening, like, like, oh, you, 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 uh, you, 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 uh, and they weren't actually like be beating him up or something like or like putting pressure on him that way, but they were just like, yeah, yeah, we will, we'll kill you, we'll beat you up if you, if, 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 X and Y and Z happens, he's like, you know, nah, so, he's strange, um, and then obviously we had the whole big thing with Alex, um, I am just going to say Alex, but well, Alex and Naomi, I mean, Alex, he had a big episode, but let's start with Alex and Naomi, um, he knows that she is putting up a front, um, and he hasn't told anyone, now he's keeping her out of danger, but I hope it's not going to come back where, like, Holden's going to be like, oh, why didn't you tell me, or, uh, he should really be saying that to Naomi, to be totally honest, like, she should be saying that to Naomi, like, oh, Naomi, why didn't you tell me, <gasps> I thought we were together, <laughs> yeah, to come together, right now, um, but, but 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 then Alex had another part of this episode which was absolutely fantastic with him and Olden. They're going in, doing a little adventure, you know. Um, what, what's the what's the what's the thing called? Uh, Indiana Jones. I keep I keep wanting to say Roy Jones, but that's the boxer Indiana Jones. You know them going on the Indiana Jones Scooby Doo adventures and uncovering the mystery. And then at the end of the episode, we had fours arriving. Um, four. Or should I say Zeus? Raijin. I don't have any other electric. Pig Pikachu. <laughs> okay. We basically had that idea and happening where like thunderstorms were happening. Um, so that basically sums up the episode. Um, that was season four, episode two. Let's hop on to season four, episode three. Yeah, let's get started. Yeah, he's causing havoc, but now with a storm, you should be worried about the storm. Spit. Yeah, you see how you see how quick he was. He was like, "That's how." Uh, it's lightning. Yo, watch the lightning strike, Coop, and Coop's gonna come like, oh, I'm back! How am I back? I don't know, but I'm back! That would be something. There's gonna be... There's gonna be trouble. That's the main thing. I think it's a good idea to actually leave. No, I don't want anyone to shoot anyone. <laughs> <laughs> First thought, like, oh, let, let me take care of this. No, no, no. 
Amos, I'm going to grab whatever spare power modules we've got on the road, and join you there. Uh, I'm almost like half certain it's like this. I, I don't know, just like come back or something. I, I don't know how he would because the lightning didn't strike him. I, well, that's just the feeling I'm getting. The lightning's continuing out across the ocean. See you there. Uh, oh, doctor, it's really not necessary. I'm coming. I'll be there soon. Now you've got to think about. Oh no, that was a ship. I was gonna say, what was that flying in the air? Is that like a thundercloud or something? But that's just, that's just a ship. You really gotta wonder, right? You really gotta wonder Secretary how much is part of the old guard and you're gonna hold that thought. Everybody finally gets a fair chance. How much you wanna clue her in? There you go. Really? Where's my pony? Where's my pony? Why should I believe you? You shouldn't. But this is your only chance to have any control of this. Never, ever, 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 ever give in to the mans, alright? Ever. If you're just gonna come back in a few years, few weeks, few months, and they're gonna ask for something else. That, that just. Got stare down. He's like, I should kill you, shouldn't I? And he's like, Try it, mate. Try it. You saw what happened to the last guy that threatened me. Did they like have a different camera for this? I mean, I already, I already pointed out that it's like shot differently, but the camera just seems better. Cinematography just seems better. You weren't using. Listen, my tree is my boss. My job is to follow orders. So don't think I won't shoot you if you pull that kind of shit again. Okay. So does that mean we're not fucking anymore? <laughs> what? <laughs> no, it... No, I guess. Cool. Okay. Cool. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. If you haven't noticed by now, Amos does what Amos does. And it works because Amos does what Amos does. <laughs> well. Thanks for coming in. We'll do all we can to get your nephew back safe and sound. There is so much like personal confrontation this season. And I'm all for it. Like, like when I say personal, I mean like the instruments on the edge of human. Israel indicate that yeah. there's it's always been human, but you get the point. Directly below the path of the lightning, several kilometers below. Jesus. Last season felt like one big ball of everything, everyone coming together, and now it feels like everyone is separate, and they're all they're all dealing with their own personal issues. Yes, it's there. Good. There are three seismometer spikes. No tectonic activity. It is. Maybe that's lifting off. That that's a ship or something. It's li and it strikes with just like the engine power. <laughs> I'm coming up with crazy speculations. Okay, leave me alone. That's kind of what I do. Crazy speculations. Yeah. When you undermine my team's authority, you put everybody here in danger, including me. Uh -huh. Is that a threat? Is that a threat? I'm just making sure you understand. Oh, I would love for it. For Emma to do the same thing I he did. When it comes to those two. The others don't get it yet, but uh, I know what you are. Huh? What is that? A killer? Yeah. I'm free right now. Uh, this is like a dog meets a bigger dog. Mercy is the dog. Amos is the bigger dog. <laughs> from, the, from the way I see it. Cover the rest. 
Gauss's people deserve the truth. Let's give it to them. That's a... I was going to say typical political play. Find something and leak it. I love politics. I love politics. I love politics. I really love politics. And I also really love how like each of them have have like a an issue that they need to solve, a, a, a nemesis, a rival, a challenge. Avasaralia, Avasarala, and Gao. Her, her, I mean, her whole situation. And you've got Amos and Metri. We're in the future, right? High-tech doors, high-tech machines, able to fly to different planets, so on and so forth. And yet you can still manipulate doors in, in that way. You can't help us, and now you want us to help you. Just having a conversation. Like you were with the man you shot? Belchus, you always play the victim. <laughs> well, we've had a lot of practice because of men like you. Men who think our lives are disposable for your own gains. Your lives? I had 23 of mine in the ground before they even set foot on. It doesn't give you the right to play judge, jury, and executioner. But he has got a good reason, though. Not while we're here. He's got a good reason. Though. You're not going to get needs away. She needs to calm down. Yes. You could, you could tell by the British. Oh, no. She is not having. Naomi. Yeah, you, you, you can actually hear I like that. You can actually hear it. <laughs> the, the breathing difficulties. You understand? What was your speaking getting her heart rate up? You. You don't know this place anything. <sighs> I hate people like that so much. That play. Psychologically. Play, play psychological Mars games. Need a lot more people like you. This weather makes no sense. Now it's raining. You may be able to hear it. Yesterday it was hailing. It was sunny all day. Then it hails. Then it's sunny. Then it rains. Then it's sunny. Alex? Linking to the Ross's fire controls. We're going to drop a torpedo on that thing. Conventional warhead. What? I can't. No, no, no. You, you can't do yes, that. Yes, I can. Watch us. <laughs> we, we are witnessing something that human beings have never seen before. Uh, and it. your first instinct is to destroy it? Yes. Yeah, before it destroys yeah, it. Yeah, exactly. There has to be something underneath powering it. Meaning something immensely and powerful. That's what we're scared of. That blows up to. If we still have time. We could go back to the settlement. We could evacuate. And in the meantime, that thing could speed up, change course, do something else we can't even imagine, and then we'd be out of options. We can't take that chance. All right. Torpedo's ready. Fire. Just like I like that action take it like no hesitation. I don't think that's gonna do anything though to be honest. But everyone should hear the torpedo. That should give everyone cause for concern. That's not gonna do anything, I'm sorry. Whatever this is. Load it down. I think it stopped. <laughs> I, I think it stopped completely. Alright. See, they're not scientists like you. They've seen a, they've seen a ton of shit. Come, we go. Ah, they're being smoked out. And there's gonna be a firing squad in front of something. War. That's what you just started. War. Everyone else can't be cool with this, honestly. I hope that answers your question. That's the end of the episode. Okay. Okay. First thing first. 
it took me a long time to finish this episode, to be totally honest. There was a few cuts. Uh, for those of you guys that watched full length, you probably noticed that they were a few cuts. <sighs> but Murtry needs to go. Murtry, like, when Amos said, should I kill him? They should have said, you know what, Amos? Yeah, you should have. The guy is problem. Absolute problems. That's what he is. He is just a menace. Um, and then obviously we have the Naomi situation. Uh, the Naomi situation. The I respect. Here's the thing that I respect. I respect the fact that like everyone is allowing her to make her own decision because, quite frankly, she is an adult. You know. Um, but what I don't like is the fact that she's making the wrong decision. <laughs> And granted, that's easy for me to say, obviously. It's, it's easy for me to say, oh, yeah, she's making a wrong decision. She's making the right decision. Yeah, she should be doing that. It's easy for me to say as a third party. I'm like, oh, yeah. But when in reality, if I was down on a planet, I'd be like, yeah, fuck that. I'm staying on this planet. I'm staying on this planet, all right? It's a new planet. I, I'm staying. Uh, as I said before, curiosity is going to get me killed one day. I am fully aware of that. And I don't mind when it does. That's a, that, that's a fact. Like, like, if there was a commission, like, oh, we have, a, like, a 2% chance to fly a rocket i'm out for some reason we'll we'll allowing civilians because there's only a two percent i'd be like i'd be like that two percent i'm like you know what this is what i said i'd be like i'd be like that person i'd be like you know what take me with you on, on your journey to mars even if there's only a two percent chance of succeeding i'd be like let's do it because i'm that curious so that's ultimately going to be my downfall i know that i'm okay with that um, but as I said, we had multiple, multiple, multiple adversaries for some of the main characters that we had. So, Avisarala. avisarala has got a new adversary in Gyao, who apparently has a shady past as well. Eh, shady, I guess. We're going to call it that. Um, troubled. Let's call, let's, call, let's call it difficult past. Um, controversial past. I think that's more like a yeah, controversial past. Where it's like, ooh, yeah, we can leak it to the public, and then we can kind of go from there. And then you obviously had... Um, the challenge that Guni was going through and ultimately she decided to stick to a moral compass now granted that seems to be i feel like that's going to be temporary i don't think the situation is resolved i don't think they would just introduce a problem and then uh have the solution be done or have the problem be completed that quickly i think it's going to be a lasting thing this season it's not going to be like oh yeah we sure won't see him ever again i think it's going to be a case of where like oh no 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 She's either going to investigate it more, or she, she, you know, the whole thing that she did with, like, um, you know, when she was, like, down there and, like, she was trying to identify that person. Obviously, that's how she noticed that he was a belter, because um, it, it, the person didn't come up on the system, and he had the whole tattoo thingy going on, um, which probably just vanished. <laughs> um, but, that, 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 either she's going to pursue it, or it's going to come back to grab her uh, it's gonna come back to like get her back into the fold i guess if that's what you if that's what you want to call it um i'm intrigued though. I'm, i have to say i am very much intrigued though by like her plot line by uh, Gunny's plot line plot line because as i said um during the reaction I, I don't know if it'll be part of the highlight version or not because it was just kind of a, of an offhand comment right so I, it's not like anything with the scenes or anything particular happening to the scenes it was just some kind of like an offhand comment but what i really like is how this season is different than last season uh, and i don't mean it in a positive or negative well, i mean i do mean it in a positive way but i don't mean that as in like last season was bad or anything it's just that i like how it's different um how it's new i guess not new but like change how it's changed from like one season to the next but like last season everyone was together they were like all the groups of people besides obviously Rala, obviously and like some of the opa folks but like the majority of people were all together in one group they were all together you know in one scenario in one situation having to figure out the issue all together now it seems a lot more personal you still have that big overall plot that is going on on new terror not a bad name honestly new terror you know it's okay it's, it's actually not that great actually it's, it's just a it's very generic on it it's a very generic name honestly new terror terror yeah okay it makes sense yeah okay it's new okay it makes sense new okay terror okay yeah it kind of makes sense but it's like it's so generic 
it it's so generic it, 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 it's it's almost a little bit disappointing like if you look at all like the planet names that we have nowadays i mean granted you look at the planet names that we have now mars and yeah that's kind of generic as well mercury kind of gen venus kind of we have a lot of like generic names like when it, whenever we discuss whenever we not discuss whenever we find at new planets we always give them some epic names like alpha centauri or uh shoot what's that one planet called uh it's like it's like x y x y something like that planet x it's like like some fancy nicknames where like if you live on that planet you're like oh yeah i'm from i'm from spongebob oh that's an epic planet name i'm from spongebob like, like that's a lot more that's a lot more creative instead of just like a new terror oh i'm from sponge steve oh sponge steve oh my you see, you could do better with a planet name. You could do better. Well, says the name. Says says the person whose channel name is Mr. X reacts. Granted, it didn't used to be that. It used to be Anime Explain because I copied that from Game Explain. And then I was like, oh, let me keep that X. And I was like, um, Mr. X reacts. And then I realized, wait, Mr. X is actually a character from Resident Evil. I didn't know that. <laughs> didn't work. Uh, one of these days, I'm gonna change my channel name to something a lot more with me because my name doesn't even start with x my name starts with a p um so that makes little to no sense um regardless that's not the point we're talking about creativity here creativity my create my most creative name has always been all right yo because that's what i always say you know i my my common phrases when i start a video is hello and welcome everybody how you all doing or all right yo hello and welcome everybody how you all doing hope you're having a fantastic day so i always say all right yo at the beginning or generally always tend to say all right yo at the beginning so that's why i'm my most creative name and then i call myself all right yo for everything else but i also had a lot more other creative names like the guy who lies i think that's a pretty good name true gaming king i don't think it's a bad name i think it's a pretty solid name too Mr. X reacts. Ooh, that's that's like, that's like, mm. but like new terror. That's like, mm, I don't know. Um, the point is, the point is, the point is, um, we obviously have that whole situation with Avicerala and Gao happening. But I feel like on New Terror, that's where we still have like the the big plot happening. And I like everywhere else, like on Mars and on Earth, we have a lot more smaller personal plots happening. Now, here's the thing, Gunny's um, plot could kind of go back to um the overall opa plot because like with this episode it being mentioned our oh, belt is perhaps opa it could kind of go back to that that would like from the very first episode that we saw from this season so is that going to be the case i can't say for sure is it not going to be the case i can't say for sure will we see i'm pretty sure um, but yeah, that's just my overall thoughts too. The episode overall was good, very good. A lot of mystery. I like mystery. I, I, I like mystery quite a lot, to be totally honest. Um, but we have to just see how it continues from here on out, because it just feels like a continuation from the last episode. Which again, it is a continuation from last. That last episode was episode two, and this was episode three. So it's obviously a continuation from that episode. <laughs> But like it felt like a very, it feel this this scene feels very much like a. Ooh. See, I was gonna say more like a, this feels more like a novel, but I know they're all made from a novel, granted. But it feels like very continuous. Like it feels like. It it feels like less of a TV season, and more like a like a book. Where like one thing is happening after the next and i'm not to say like in a previous season it didn't feel like one thing's happening after the next but like in the previous season you could feel like okay the end of the episode feels like a short break if that makes sense uh like, like you finish the episode and, and then you come back to the next episode and it's like oh a day has passed oh a week has passed oh a few hours have passed oh a month has passed oh a year has passed whereas with this season so far i mean right we're only you know barely in, in the season but with this season it feels like oh we're literally continuing from where we left off, like no minute, no second, no hour, no day, no week, no fortnight, no month, no, you know, year, no decade, no century, no millennia, no anime millennia, no, I don't know what comes beyond that, but no, 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 none of that has passed, all right, we're just like, we're, like, we're continuing right where we left off, which really feels like a book almost, like, you know, there is no chapter, it's just one continuum. 
one continuous story, I guess. Um, but that's just overall my thoughts. So on the season so far, granted, we're only barely in. So maybe it's a bit too soon for me to say. But that's my um, reaction, my um, review, um, and my um, video done for this episode. Regardless of ladies and gentlemen, I'll be seeing you all in the next one. Everyone, until then, have a nice day. Peace out and bye. That was a... That was me speaking pretty quickly, I have to say. I like speaking quickly, but I always try and like slow myself. I, I, my usual speed is like pretty quickly, but I always like try and slow myself down because so people can understand me. People that you know, maybe are not native English speakers can understand me, but, but um, my general speaking sentence words per minute is like at 500. <laughs> I, I, I just rumble, 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 rumble. That's basically a rumble, 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 which my, my lips are getting quite dry right now. But regardless, ladies and gentlemen, I'll be seeing you all in the next one, everyone. Until then, have a nice day. Peace out and bye. Hey, everybody. If you like this video, please be sure to rate, comment, favorite, and subscribe. And if you want to see more of these kind of videos, be sure to check out Patreon to get one week early access as well as full length. Until next time, everybody. Peace out and have a nice day.